when you increase your short chain fatty acid levels, you get more good byproducts. You get energy for your colon, but also for your brain. Also, help with intestinal motility and lastly, reduce inflammation. So you can hit multiple things, right? So this is a really, really big deal. All right, so last, I, I just wanna tie this all together. So we've talked about gut-brain axis being a two-way street, okay? So your brain impacts your gut, your gut impacts your brain. Today, we've really focused on what happens from the gut to the brain, even though on another day, we really do need to talk about the brain and the gut because, hey, it's all connected. And best health comes from treating the body as a whole and not as individual pieces. The more complex cases don't get better when you separate them and these little pieces. But when you deal with the dysbiosis, the inflammatory response, neurotransmitters, which once again, get improved as you improve the health of the gut, your short chain fatty acids come in, they stimulate the vagus nerve. Vagus nerve helps with anti-inflammatory output. 